Hello again everyone, this is your host Beast of Vecina 7 with The Oversight. Uh, yes, in the last part we did a tiny amount of work in some of these rooms, not that one. And <clears throat> I think it's time to continue once more. So, goblins. Let's kill them. Yeah, I like that idea. Killing goblins is always a nice idea. When in doubt, kill goblins. Yeah, they yeah, sure got this. I have to kill. <laughs> yep, commentary is all dead tonight. I probably killed it. Doesn't surprise me, I tend to kill my commentary very often. Doesn't seem to mind surprisingly. So, it's a fun life, a fun set of dominoes. It's all nice though, and so some of them start to fall. I always come crying to the mommy saying, Oh, my dominoes are gone! Except it doesn't even make sense in this context, so what the heck? Anyway, goblins. They sure died. Okay, what the heck? <coughs> the floor is transparent here, and Bethro can see an old, desiccated skeleton below. The gravestone reads, Here lies Mothro Butkin. By the gravestone lies a sword. A capybara appears close by. One of... One of your very distant ancestors, it says. He lived about 700 years ago. He threw eye, he eyes the sword. Go on, take it, says the capybara. He left it here for you. Bethel carefully examines it. It looks exactly like mine, he says. Look, it even has scratches in the, in the same places. I think that's the whole point, says the capybara. Try picking it up. Bethel tries to pick up the sword, but it's either too heavy or too insubstantial. And it remains on the ground. Okay. So there's gonna be more stuff to the south. Gotcha. Okay. Onwards with our lives then. Uh, my next direction. Should be the room directly to the north. <coughs> Alright. No, I think that was a wrong judgment. I need to come in from the south there. So I'm gonna go up here with all those queens. Roach Banzai. Banzai Banzai? Oh no, I feel like I can see where this is going. Where this is going. So very stupid, very quickly. Or maybe not. What am I, I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, no, never mind. I was afraid of the worst. But the worst was really just a cup of ice cream. Anyway. Um, yes. Hmm. Okay, this area is starting to give some trouble. Uh, the proper protection that is. Never smite roaches without proper protection, kids. Bethel doesn't have protection because he's an expert. He knows what he's doing, but you don't, so don't try this at home. At least not without the proper protection. 
I mean, he knows what he's doing. And he's been doing it for several years. That's why he doesn't have protection. He's the exception to the rule because he's no, he knows what he's doing, and you don't. Because you're just some impressionable child or something. Actually, I would know because I don't know you. But if I were to wager a guess, maybe that's what you are. I don't know. I don't... I honestly don't care, really. It doesn't matter. For the sake of things, I'm just gonna... Did you do this room the easy way or the hard way? I did it I, the I don't care way. <laughs> Enough of this. 9090909090900909 Anomaly. 9090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090909090
Maybe. Well, I don't know. Uh, am I? I don't know. I don't care. I look like someone who cares. Maybe I do, but maybe I don't. So, uh, yeah, whatever. In your face and etc. And other assorted beverages. It's probably Greek. But then again, as I said, I don't care. So, you know. The life of a Mor uh, Moroccan prince. And his descendants. Yes, they all live with him. It would make for the funniest sitcom, except not really. Because it's almost tragic, in a way. Why? Because the show doesn't exist. Why is it tragic that the show doesn't exist? Because it's your, it's your mom's favorite. That's why. Hmm. Now that's just interesting. Okay, so trap doors. Under all of them? What? Looks like I need to try to partake in some sort of crazy witchcraftery. Dying here. Oh, wait a minute. I know how to deal with this. It's so obvious. Ah, that's beautiful. I like this. Why don't I see this pattern more often? It's a beautiful pattern. It's like, oh, yeah, we're just well, we're too lazy to make this pattern. And that's. Let's have two by fours and those weird L shapes. No, it's, a, it's no elegance these days, you know? What am I rambling about again? Gosh, Bloom, an old guy. He's so old and old. Yeah, he's like a hundred and a half years old. Okay, so the ribbon. It's probably something beautiful in all of this. Wait, do I need it to come help me? Well, I can't clear all that stuff on my own, so yeah, I think so. Well, it's not like it really matters anyway, because... I could just do this. It's so much fun. I'm having the time of my life and stuff. Uh, I should be careful. And down you go. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, I think that's right. I need to leave that one behind though, because it's gonna help me. It's gonna help me retrieve the lost crown of something something. Or is he? Maybe it's just a trap. It wouldn't surprise me if I had to deal with several in the past week. No, it seems to me like uh, I can't drop that one in an orderly manner. So it has to be this. But if I drop this, I can make it through. Okay. 
But then I need to have a way to get myself in there. Yeah, I also need a way out. Out of this mess. Okay, so... Can't start anywhere else. Okay, this one cannot be dropped because otherwise these chapters will never be dropped and I need to drop them all. So that square becomes the one I need to keep around. But rather to mimic destination square. Oh, wait a minute. That's it's possible. I can just do this. Yeah, there we go. That's beautiful. Okay. It's all about doing it right, I guess. No one cares about the rest of this. The best of this. Okay, now I just need to do this. Excellent. The king appears before Bethro once again, chuckling to himself about some obscure joke. Ha! He says. So you're the exterminator, eh? Ella told me all about you. How are you doing? Fine, thanks, says B. Thor and then remembers. Wait a second. Didn't you just tell me to get out? The king frowns. Well, he says. It might be wise if you did stick around too long after you finished the job. It gets dangerous here, you know, even with no monsters about. The king's face brightens. No, he says. That must have been someone else, dressed up as me, that told you to go away. You get lots of imposters around here these days, you know? Something about this explanation strikes Bethro as slightly wrong, but the king has vanished again. Yeah, I don't trust that guy. Racetrack Elite version. So... Drop this thing. Kills Goblin. Hit that orb. The snake is there too. It's probably a mimic potion. There he is. Nothing closes this, so I can just keep it for later. Okay, so elite race. Gotcha. Pop. Maybe it would be better if I went up there already. Ah, yeah, there are trapdoors too. It says no. Okay. Maybe my spawn in there? Do I look like I care? I can go back in there, anyways. Nothing stopping me from doing that. Should be able to turn that snake a little better. Okay, two more spawn cycles after that. Alright, I think I made it just in time. Excellent. Oh boy, that was close. <laughs> that was really close. Okay, so that was actually not that easy. I will say, I was expecting that to be a lot easier than that. Then again, this is a pretty tough hold, so at the same time, I'm not that surprised. But, eh, slightly, maybe a little, maybe bit. Little, maybe bit, yeah. Way to word appropriately. Inappropriate wording. Okay, so. The Tormented Dreams. Alright, time to torment some dreams up in this place. Okay. Vito finds a book on the floor. It's eight, 1800 ways to skin a cat. 
by Epi Denki Twiskas Jr. Self-help manual, perhaps? Lethal pocket set. Might be useful for later. Wait, didn't he reject one of those earlier on? Well, I'll say that. It's already a lot less bothersome than that one room from... Uh, that series of rooms from... I do believe it was the compilation... The, no, the Tomb of Noom. Yeah, that, that one. Yeah, it's, it's better than that. By a small amount. But seriously though, what am I doing here? Okay, so that one. Okay, I need to come in down from there. Got you. I shall do that immediately. Combo, combo, ah. New combos. Okay. Gotta be a way to combo this. Yeah, these two are just not gonna allow me to combo them. What ungrateful jerks! Being combos is the best thing ever. It's like a heavenly Nirvana-like experience. Well, I mean, you can't really get much Nirvana now, though, because uh, their lead singer died a while back. But you know, I mean, it's. Uh, the replacement experience isn't that bad, I don't think, you know? So, um... What can I expect from this? Does that just get me in the same place I was earlier? I should try to come in from that angle. Oh, I could toggle it. Some kind of placement. Yeah, I could do this. Hey, I'm inside. And it's just, uh... Two, uh... Oh, wait a minute. May need to better position my mimic. Okay, good. I don't know, I just get that feeling that I might need to do that. I mean, it's never a bad thing. Little journey across the land. It's never really hurts. Okay. That's that for the tar. Stop, stop hot keying. Okay. So, about that roach. Can I even get out? Wait, I think I might have done this wrong. Maybe I'm supposed to start there, then I do some stupid heroics to get him over here, and then I do the... Oh no. 
Yeah, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Yeah, that makes a lot more sense, and also feel like it's gonna be a less, a lot less uh, tricky to pull off than the previous attempts at my life. And or on my life, but that's uh, that's a whole different story. I will never cover ever because uh, I don't know. I just gotta delay you. There we go. That's good for me. Okay, seriously, you're just gonna keep spawning that jerk over there? Yeah, you're spawning enemies at worst. Okay, that's your turn. Alright, so she's dead. It's about darn time it happened. Something, something, the old ball and chain. Yeah, that, 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 that has morbid implications, but I'll move along happily, ignoring the circumstances of our lives, because think about it for even one second, it would just be too grim for all of us, now would it? I think we're best off living a happy life. Never thinking about what's wrong with everything. Or anything for that matter. Yeah. I thought to not protest. So. Same strategy? Okay, alright, let's uh, redo this. Clean room is clean. Now let's do the same. Stepperoonies. And then, through some miracle, I should be able to end up on this side. Which is where I always want to be. Wait, what? I can't go there because these stupid things are in the way. Well, that's just not nice. <sighs> Do this again! Yay! More roaches! Well, it's the same roaches, only they're different versions. Fifteen. Disappointing numbers. I don't have to debate on that. Let's just go down. Oh, wait a minute. A capybara walks towards B3. Why are you here? It hisses. Oh, of course, you can't answer that. You'd better leave. Oh, of course, you can't answer that. But you better leave. I can kill you with no trouble at all. A scrap of memory returns to B3. But you called me here! What? says the capybara angrily. Your name is Ella, and you serve the king with the capital K. How do you know this? I can't remember. What's your name? Uh, but she can't remember, says Ella. You're right, I can't remember. I think it's either Beethro or Dugan. The capybara looks somehow surprised. Well, perhaps there's a third name you should be considering. What? What? Anyway, I shall see you again. The capybara vanishes. Okay, this is just getting a little silly now. Then again, it is a surrealist domain, but man, you really... Are you hampering in on the surreal there, buddy? Anyway... I need to get that mimic potion, but how? Oh! Oh, 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 oh! Same way I got in, I guess. With magic and other substitutes.
Alright, and now for the final touches. Kills Bane. It's a mimic. Uh, let me try to actually grab it. Gotcha. Let's go up. It's really. Kill everything inside. Favorite pastime. Okay, an entire subgenre of people. You probably already know which one. Murderers. But that's besides the point. Anyway, uh. Doing this once again, but after that we have a mimic to put up with. But after that, this should be done with. Don't see anything else being uh, worthy of such troubles. Frankly, it's one of the easier multi-passes puzzles I've had to go through in basically ever. Really, I mean, I've played through several of these in uh, Jacob Holds. And they were way tougher there than they are here. Than, he, than it is here. Whatever. I don't care about the wording. My mom cares about the wording. Anyway. Other words. High bra quality ca uh, comedy. Cameras, yes. Broken watch. Wu, where, wu, when, how? Questan, Roer, Paitai, Line, Lai, Lai, Nurk, Aware, Rirti, Opthruians. Oh, my head hurts. Broken watch. Okay, so what is the point of that watch? Okay, so Mimic fights enemies. actually going to prove to be a bit difficult. Or not. Well, I can pretend that it is, but really that doesn't benefit anyone in the end. Plop. I'm getting a feeling that we'll be going back to the uh, once east room at the end. Just a, just a feeling. A gut feeling, maybe. This is interesting. Uh... Hmm. Perhaps I should align the mimic with myself. If that's even possible. There we go. And we have clear. And that was over. So let's just go down. However, that's meant to be done. Right, to that room, okay. Time for some friendly backtracking. And by friendly I mean tedious. Because those are two uh, those are totally two words that mean the same thing. Totally rolling eyes. Exasperatively. 